Start of the Ant Farm course is at the Sheriff's Pistol Range, just inside Hart Park, looking at the Sheriff's Pistol Range Hill. This is a 5K course. You do it 10 times to get a 50K, or you can do it as many laps as you want. This is the aid station area, meaning you do your own aid, so leave stuff in the car, come by and refuel, rehydrate. I've got Pistol Range Hill to the top, about a half mile climb. Here you're at the top of Pistol Range Hill. You can take a right onto this single track, which we call Ridge Line, and it's not going to be on this trail very long, but you can go down and make a U-turn and then head back and get onto Pistol Range Hill. It'll be marked with orange showing you where it goes. That was the ridge line you just ran on. Drop down. Don't go that way. Go back up this trail, the single track. You can see the orange ribbons. It'll run into the pistol range dirt road, which you'll hang a right on. There's the ridge line trail that you just took. Hang a right. Get on the fire road. Head up the fire road for another half mile or so. Here's like kind of the top of it, a little over a mile. You get to this fence line, you're going to turn left on the fence line and follow the fence line. Follow the fence line all the way back down, basically where you came from. This fence line trail does run right alongside the fire road, so you'll be able to see your fellow runners, walkers. That's the trail you just went down, you follow the fence line, there's the fire road. You're going to go straight through here through these gates and take that fire road that's right in front of you. And then that fire road will lead you to the refrigerator trail that's going to take you down into that canyon. Fire road you came down, make a sharp right, and you get on this trail called Refrigerator Trail, which runs parallel to Pistol Range Hill. This fire trip, this refrigerator trail leads you to the toad's exit. There's another view of the refrigerator trail. See where it drops down. There's the toad's exit. I'm going to go up this trail, which I call Owl Trail. At the top of that, it's about mile two. Here you are at mile two, looking down Owl Trail. See where you came from. Nice part about this course is you can kind of see other people on it throughout the day. Lots of climbs, lots of descents. You're going to go over there and you're going to go up Skunk Trail over to Lindy Hop. It's a view from the top of the Skunk Trail. When you get to the top of this, you're going to have to turn, make a sharp left, and just follow this trail that overlooks Hart Park. Hence the name Overlook Park. This little section here I call Lindy Hop. I'm just going to take that trail that cuts across that little hill. There's another view of the Lindy Hop. It's going to take you to the, old, the main overlook trail that drops down to the parking lot where your car is parked. So just stay with the ridge line overlooking Hard Park and you'll be fine. Should be marked with orange ribbons again. This part's kind of steep. See where you just came down that pretty steep trail. You're going to hang a left here and go down this trail, which is called Overlook Trail, which will drop down and take you back to the cars, which is our aid station area. You have to provide your own aid. View at the bottom of Overlook Trail. This Overlook Trail will run into another little trail that runs parallel with Pistol Range. Take this upper single track trail back to the cars where you can get more water. Hopefully, you brought stuff, supplies. It runs parallel with the Pistol Range Hill. And this will be a 5K course. You can do it as many laps as you like. I'm planning on doing 10 for a 50K or 31 miles.